I'm John Pelletier from Solid Fire Product Management. Today I'll show you how to create a data store backed by a Solid Fire fiber channel volume on vSphere 6 with our vCenter plugin. You can launch our plugin from the home screen in vCenter if you have user credentials for all data store management functions. For each discovered cluster, there are management tabs for data stores, accounts, volumes, and volume access groups. From the Data Store tab, let's create a new data store. The Creation Wizard allows you to make simple choices about the data store, including which hosts should have access, how big your volume should be, and how your QoS, min, max, and burst values should be set. The wizard allows you to choose CHAP or a volume access group, iSCSI or Fiber Channel. All volumes added to a volume access group are accessible by any initiators in that same group, Fiber Channel or iSCSI. You can even have one host accessing the volume by Fiber Channel and another by iSCSI. The wizard also allows our QoS to integrate with VMware's SIOC settings but we'll save that for another demo. The wizard then creates the volume with your desired settings, makes it visible to any initiators in your volume access group, automatically rescans your host's initiators so that they see the new volume, and mounts the new data store on it, saving you lots of work. As long as the data store has no VMs in it, you can easily delete it from the data store view and it will give you the option to delete the backing volume as well. Thanks for watching.